Normally, when I carry this uh, system in the field, I've always carry it inside my t-shirt. So it's already, it's all the way down. You can see it conceals very nicely. Let me get the cord not out of the way. You can see it conceals very nicely. There's, you just, no one would really guess that there's an entire survival knife and kit hanging around your neck. And it's very safe. I've never in almost 20 years of using a neck knife in a survival conditions, I've never had it snag on anything. It's always been under my shirt. If I'm using it, I'll pull it out, I'll, I'll use it, and then I'll put it away and drop it back inside my shirt. Um, even then, there are certain activities I would not want this thing tied around my neck, especially like in an urban area. You don't want to be walking around with a double paracord garret around your neck. So if I'm in an urban area or a place where I don't want the thing around my neck, you can take it off. Uh, the easiest way to do it is to loop it through your belt. Just tie it to your belt like that, and then you can just pop it in a pocket and the whole thing just disappears in a pocket and uh, it's very secure that way. Um, the other thing you can do with it, which I... Uh, you can carry an appendix very easily. Where the whole thing just, just pops under your shirt, run to your belt line if you're not already carrying your gun there. But it just disappears. Uh, there at, at appendix and it's actually comfortable you can sit you can drive you can do whatever you want check your local laws you don't want to be carrying a concealed weapon well who am i kidding you you do want to be carrying a concealed weapon just check your local laws make sure you're not going to get in trouble all right and then that is right there and the rubber sheath on the outside actually forms it's like one of those grippy holsters where you don't draw the sheath with it because it's got the rubber it sticks to your clothing so that's an alternate way of carrying uh this um if you want to lengthen the cord a little bit, you can actually sling it uh, around your neck and one shoulder. I'm not going to do that because the cord's not set up for it, but if you set the cord up, you can actually use it like a baldric under a shirt and carry it around and you're not going to get it caught around your neck if that's something you're concerned about. I have never once gotten this cord snagged uh, and I've taken this from Alaska to southern Brazil. So it's a good system. I. Uh, Every time I'm in the bush, every time, unless I was on alone, where I couldn't take this, I carry this system. Well, I carry the old system, and now I will be carrying the new system. Thanks for watching.